Let's start off with the Aqualogica's Glow Plus Dewy Dew Drops. And I'm using this as an additional moisturizer and a illuminator. I've already used SPF and moisturizer, but I want my look to, you know, my face to feel extra hydrated for this makeup look since we are not using any concealer or foundation. So you can use it with your brush or even a beauty blender or even your fingers. I just chose the brush. Now I'm using the Rimmel Matte Primer. Now this is not a ordinary matte primer you can see this has a very different consistency than the ordinary primers which are available especially the silicone ones which give you a matte finish this is completely different to that but it gives you the same results and your pores are filled and your skin looks matte and also poreless which gives a great canvas for your face to blend in the other products now instead of the foundation and concealer i'm using the l'oreal compact this has a full coverage finish uh, not like full full coverage but you can say like a higher coverage than your normal powder i'm just taking a powder puff you can take a brush but i'm using it and i'm just applying it all over my face in this way remember to put it in in this way now as you can see from the difference which you'll see it in just a second it gives you this coverage it is not high coverage but it is still better than nothing it's very light it does not look like you have applied any foundation or concealer that's why i like this whenever i feel very lazy i just go ahead and apply this and you do not have to drag it but dab it on your face for my eyebrows i'm using the elf uh, brow pencil i usually have very thick brows so i don't need much maintenance to it so all i do is just go ahead and you know comb them out for my blush and highlighter i'm using the elf duo this is the elf uh, peachy blush which i have i think there are two or three variants in this but i'm using the blush as an eyeshadow because i want a monochrome kind of a look going on on my face again it is pigmented and i'm using the highlighter shade as uh, a shimmer on my eyelids just to keep it very simple and you know just to have very less products in this makeup look so i've applied it both of them are decently pigmented as you can see now using the same palette again i'm using the blush shade as an actual blush on the high points of my face and applying it now this is not a you know extremely pigmented blush on the first go but you will see that it is buildable what i like to do is take a little bit tap on the excess and just you know blend it out just some for sometimes you know what if i just apply it too much i don't want that mistake to happen that's why i just tap off the excess and i keep on applying a little little bit and then slowly build up the pigmentation however i want and the highlighter as well as you can see it's not extremely blinding but it's still there you can see the pigment up on your face which is a great you know buildable highlighter so this is a great duo which i like for my mascara i'm using a a uh, very underrated mascara which is the Zayn and Maiza mascara this is under 350 rupees and i was blown away by the fact that it performs so so well so again i am applying it all over my lashes and the wand is pretty good i would say it is very close to the l'oreal ones now for my lipstick i'm finishing it up with the kiro nutmeg liquid lipstick this is again a great great shade i've been using this for years and years it's a perfect nude i feel like for all indian skin tones and that is my look complete the no foundation no concealer makeup look very easy using very few products and it gives you the great way to you know uh, look very good without having to apply a lot of products let me know what do you think make sure to watch this video and subscribe for more such videos bye